over in Vancouver schools, but there is still some controversy after the school board approved a $5,000 raise for the superintendent. Now, it's part of a cost of living increase, but the decision comes as non-teaching staff is still trying to negotiate their contract. Coin 6's Jennifer Dowling is live with a report on how those who attended that meeting are responding. Good afternoon. Well, we talked to one paraeducator, and she said, in the very least, the decision was a little tone deaf, as those uh, educators are still working to negotiate a contract. And they've been doing so for quite some time. Now, the superintendent's pay will go up to a little more than $254,000. And while the teachers' new contracts have been decided, Vancouver, Vancouver paraeducators, including secretaries and teaching assistants, are still negotiating their pay increases. The talks have been underway since the spring. A spokesperson for the group says at the beginning of the year there was also a shakeup in staff. They were transferred to different buildings and their titles changed. Some had their clinical hours taken away as well. A number of people wore red in support of them at the board meeting. We have paraeducators who are really in the line of fire um, and working their hearts out because they love their kids. These are people who know students best. And I really feel that they deserve some not just you know not just words we deserve respect financially as well the school district issued a statement saying all Vancouver public schools employees received a 3.1 percent state cost of living adjustment for the school year at last night's board meeting the board acted only to extend the contract through June 2021 but made no improvement to the salary base except for the cost of living adjustment now that superintendent salary is in line with other big districts in the metro area we'll have more on that at five and six back to you Jennifer Dowling live for us in Vancouver thank you